Hello everybody and welcome to my new Let's Play. This is episode zero where I asked you, the viewer, because there's definitely not more than one. Um, hi mom, by the way. Um, I'm going to be playing uh, Sailor Moon. Uh, what is it called? Uh, it's, I think it's just Bishoujo. Sailor Bish Bishou I can't even, I don't even know. It's uh, Bishoujo Senshi Sailor Moon. Which actually means pretty warrior say that move because it's manly this is the manliest game ever i could be playing dragon ball z which is another show for my childhood but instead i choose uh say the moon so i'm going to show you guys this real quick this this first option here is the difficulty when i play the game it will be on this one right here which is hard but i will also have this here which is your continues up to seven because i'm terrible at the game and uh, the way it plays out is you have five lives. When you use those five lives, you use a continue. Um, hopefully, I will not have to use too many continues, but um, I have seven there just because I don't want to have to restart the entire game. Though I am going to be using save states at the beginning of each level, except for the first one because there's really no point. And I'm going to be uh, trying to play this game on hard because there's an additional boss when you play it hard. Um, these here are sound tests, if you play the game yourself, um, so you can hear, hear uh, Sailor Moon there, with her attacks. Yeah, that's amazing, that's cool. Um, I always like sound tests, they're always really cool, especially when you get, like, the tracks from the game. Alright, I'm gonna see if there's an opening here, aside from this. You got the uh, Say the Moon theme song, Moonlight Didn't Set Suit. I'm playing it there. I should also say this is the Genesis version, which you probably noticed, which came out a year after the Super Nintendo version and does not feature a two player mode, which is kind of lame, but its graphics are better and I don't have another person to play with, anyways. And even if I did, who's going to play Sailor Moon with me? Seriously. Seriously. Like. Actually, you know what? Who wouldn't want to play Sailor Moon? Alright, I don't know if there's like a little opening cutscene, so... So yeah, I'm playing this game because I love Sailor Moon. Uh, as, as a kid, I, I watched it all the time. It was, it was Sailor Moon and Dragon Ball Z all the time. Alright, this might be it. Oh yeah, get a little... Uh, look at the bad guys of the series. This is uh, based on the first season. I can't remember those guys' names. I can't even remember the lady. Uh, I just remember Jedite, who is that one there. I'm pointing at him. I don't want to look like an idiot, so I'm not going to say. I can't remember which one was Jedite. Oh well. Anyways, there's, there's text. It's in Japanese, which... I cannot read at all. I can understand some Japanese if it's written in Roman characters. But okay. <laughs> That's the same thing over and over again. Um Alright, so this is the opening cutscene. If you understand Japanese, are Go ahead and post in the comments what it says. I'm sure I could find out what it says, but it's not important to me because I've watched the series before and I know what's going on, sort of. So yeah, I needed a manly game to play. You probably heard that, me setting down my glass, which is actually made of glass, and I also have a glass desk. So I'm going to have, have to be careful with that because that's going to make a lot of noise, especially with this new microphone. Mm-hmm. Mars is upset about something. I'm trying to set down my glasses as quietly as possible. I just have to have a drink of cola every now and then. Gosh. Alright. So, um, the reason I'm playing this, obviously, is, uh... Well, the reason I'm playing the Genesis version rather than the Super Nintendo version is because it has a bit better graphics and the sound quality is a bit better. So here are the five characters you can play in this game. 
uh, it's a shame you can't play as Tuxedo Common, but, or Tuxedo Mask, whatever you want to call it. Uh, but, you got, uh, Utsagi here, uh, who is pretty good. Um, she's, she, I think she's kind of like an all-around character, she does everything alright. Um, her special ability is Moon Healing, what am I talking about? I can't, I can't remember what it's called, but basically, it's... <sighs> I, I, you know what, I'm, I'm just gonna show them off. I'm gonna show off all the characters, what they can do. I'm gonna try to keep it quick. Hopefully I get in all their abilities for all the characters. This is gonna be a long episode, long first episode. It's gonna take like 10 days to upload it because my internet sucks. So we got Sailor Moon here. You got her punch, you got her jump, and you got this ability. Moon Healing Escalation, which uh, y your special ability like that takes away your health. So it, I, I probably won't ever be using them. Uh, you also got your jump, your forward jump, uh, which she does a flip and you can attack while doing that. And then if you press it down while attacking in the air, you do that ability. Uh, you have a charge ability when you hold down your punch. Moon TR action, awesome. Um, she also has another ability, which you press down and up really quick, and then uh, press A, which I can never do. She has that ability, so those are all of her abilities. Also, if you double tap and then jump, you do a fast um, jump, and then you, you have a more powerful kick. But it doesn't work with your down attack, so. Um, that's Sailor Moon, basically. That's pretty much all she has. And so I'll be right back with the next character. Alright, we're back. And one more thing about Sailor Moon is her name is Utsagi Tsukino, which actually means, I've, I've heard, I'm not 100% sure if it's true, but it sounds right, Bunny of the Moon. So there's that little information tidbit for you. And now we're on to um, Sailor Mercury. Also known as Ami Mizuno, which means friend of water, which I assume that's correct as well, hopefully. I don't want to look too much like a fool. And uh, her moves, all the characters' moves are pretty much, um, you, they pretty, the input is the same for all of them. Uh, the only thing that's different is their special moves, which was that little cry thing she did. And it'll be... That's, that's her special move, which is forward, down, forward, and then you do that. Anyways, this is how her punch works. It's pretty short range, but it's not too bad. Uh, her jump, she has the best, I think, jump in the game. The highest, at least. Um, and her dash, uh, her dash kick. Um, come on. Uh, her down attack. Special ability, which takes her health down, and then bubble spray, which is her charge. So that's pretty much all there is to Ami here. And now on to the next character. And I started the video a little late, but um, this is Mars, Sailor Mars, also known as Ray Hino, which apparently means Spirit of Fire. Again, not 100% sure of that. demo her moves real quick. Um, she, I think, has the fastest, like, combo attack uh, when she's attacking, so basically she's pretty fast, but uh, again, controls are the same as everybody else except for her special move. Uh, I think every special move is different. Why am I not moving? Oh, yeah. really hope you guys don't see it when I do that, because I always accidentally do that. Fire Tornado. This is her attack again. Not the best range, but pretty decent. Actually, not pretty decent. I think that is the shortest range. Usagi might have a shorter range, but there's her dash jump. There's her kick, and that's her down. Uh, her charge is Fire 
soul, and that's her take your health away ability. So I think that's all for her. On to the next character, my personal favorite, so I'll be right back. Okay, we're back. This has been my favorite character in the series for like the whole series. Sailor Jupiter. Um, also known as um, Marco Lo Kino, which apparently means Wisdom of the Trees again. Not really 100% sure about that. But she has the worst jump in the game. She doesn't even do a flip. How lame is that? But she does a pretty cool kick. And then her down is like... Ah! But I think she's the most powerful character. She has the second best range in the game. Because she does a kick. Um, her special ability is... Well, not her special ability, but her C button is this. And then her special ability, I think... That it's forward, up, down, and it's called, I think, just ground down. And that's our, her Supreme Thunder, which is her charge attack. Achaw. Her charge attack. So that's all there is to uh, her. Now, the last character in the game will be right. And this is Minako Aino, which her name, I think, means Messenger of Love. Again, not 100% sure. AKA Sailor Venus. Uh, I, one thing I haven't been sh showing off is every character has grab moves. Um, so there's that. <laughs> um, I don't know how to use them really. It's usually just, it happens. I've never really gotten to learn them. I just let it happen. I don't really care. But uh, I think Jupiter has a special one where you rotate the uh, D pad really quick and she's like an X. But I'd never do it, so. Um, this is her attack, her normal attack. It is the best range in the game, and it's the reason why um, she's recommended for beginners. Uh, she has really good range. She has a really nice jump animation as well. I really like that. Um, this is her attack, and this is her uh, special, her special charge attack. Which is crescent beam. C button attack, which takes her life, is that, and then her, shoot, I really dislike her uh, special ability, it's up, down, forward, which is a grab move, I'll see if I can show it off on this guy here, and that's it, that's her special ability, um, which I don't like, and this is, <laughs> this is her down attack, which is Pretty nice. And, uh, dash jump. So that's all there is for Minako. Um, and I think that's gonna do it for the episode, uh, episode zero of this uh, series. Let's see if I can break this sign here. Ha! Um, just uh, if somebody's actually watching this, go ahead and leave a comment uh, about which which character you'd like to see me play through. Hopefully, I can get a few comments get like a majority vote for a character. If not, I'll just do some random number generator stuff and uh, do that. So, uh, yeah, just leave a comment of what character you want me to play as. I will be trying to play this game on hard so I can get the unlock the bonus boss and I will be playing with seven continues and save states at the beginning of levels. So I will see you guys when I actually start this. Hopefully we'll get some comments about the character. Goodbye!